Doni, nun. Okay, so we've arrived. We're going to go in and check it out. Well, a very good afternoon from Phuket. Today is Saturday the 29th of June and as the mother-in-law is visiting us, we're going over to a restaurant. Now, I've not been to this restaurant before. It is one that Nat's sister, too, has recommended. It's on the east side of the island, so a few hidden gems on that side of the island that we're trying to search out to recommend people to get you out the tourist areas. As you know, I like to get people out the tourist areas into the more, shall we say, Thai area rather than the tourist areas because the food is normally a lot better and the prices are much more pocket friendly. So this restaurant is in an area called Pak Claw, if I've pronounced that right. I will put all the details down in the description. So stay with us and let's see what this restaurant's like. So we're getting close to the restaurant now and just down the bottom of this road in front of us is actually a ferry terminal. Okay, so we've arrived. We're going to go in and check it out. The restaurant is called Ban Long Seafood a Restaurant, right next to the ferry terminal here, so very easy to find. And we're going to have some great views, or so I've been told. As I say, first time here, so let's go in and check this restaurant out. Looks like we're in the uh, mangroves. I can just see the restaurant through the trees there. According to two, this restaurant opens at 10.30 in the morning and closes around 6.30 in the evening. So this is more of a lunchtime, early evening place. So if you're looking to come over here, just bear that in mind. And as far as I know, it's open every day. Okay, the ladies just bought the menus over and they actually have menus in English as well as a Thai, so that's handy to know. Don't panic if you come in here and you don't speak Thai, thinking, oh, is it going to all be in Thai and not know what to order? They have menus in English. Let's have a quick look, give you an idea of prices and also some of the dishes they do here. I'm not going to spend too much time on the menus because obviously menus can be a little bit boring to be staring at, but it'll give you an idea of the sort of dishes the restaurant does. Steamed fish with lemon, steamed fish with plum sauce. Sounds good. Okay, so some of the food is now starting to come out. <coughs> what is this, Nat? Unim. 
crab. Crab. Okay. Fried crab, yeah? Yeah. Deep fried garlic. crab. With garlic. Pepper. Yep. Nice. And this one? Uh, for fish sauce, you. Fish sauce. Salad. Mango for... salad for fish. Oh, mango salad for the fish, fish. that I've ordered. Yeah. Okay. That looks like uh, egg fried rice with seafood, yes? This one, uh, fried crab. Crab. Fried rice crab, okay. Egg fried rice with crab. Shell. Shell, yeah. Hoi clang. Okay. Fish sauce. Okay. I'll take it, that one's the one Fish for me. Good. Yeah. Tamarind sauce. Tamarind sauce. Okay. We've got prawns with tamarind, prawn, yes? Yeah, prawn tamarind. And what's the name of this one, Nat? Kapung. Kapung, that's it. I can never remember the name. I do like this particular fish. And we also have some crab. fresh crab. Mm -hmm. <laughs> A feast oh, you know, for a king here today. Wow. I think we're going to be very, very full indeed. Okay, well, I had thought that we'd got all the food, but no, there's another dish coming out here as well. Which has got the burners underneath it to keep it nice and hot. In fact, it's probably cooking it, to be honest. And what's this, Nat? Okay, so it's the same fish yeah, cooked same in fish. a different way. We buy for one fish and then uh, we cook for two. Right. Fish sauce and then kapong. Okay. Lovely. That looks delicious. Wow. Oh, in. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's tuck in. Oh. Oh. I'm looking forward to this. Okay, go on. Well, as you can see, we are still going. Not quite finished it. There is an awful lot of food there. And I've got to say, coming from a person that's not a big lover of seafood, as you will know if you follow my channel regular, that food was absolutely delicious. The fish, the deep fried fish that I had was really nice. The mango salad, a little bit on the spicy side, but for me, it was nice. I really enjoyed it. The setting here is excellent. I've asked everybody what they thought because it's our first time, everybody's first time. This is something that Nat's sister suggested we try. It's called the Ban Rong Seafood Restaurant and it's at Ban Rong Pier. I may have said it was Ban Long earlier on, but it's Ban Rong. That's the correct pronunciation of Pier just over here. There's various boats that go out from here, tour boats, etc. But if you want to, have some really good seafood. They do do a few dishes that aren't seafood dishes like chicken cashew nuts and that type of dishes. They also do those, but it is mainly a seafood restaurant. And I've got to say, very nice. I tried all of the dishes apart from the cockles because I'm, I'm not um, a shellfish person. It's not something that I really enjoy, the, sh the, the shellfish. But everybody has said the food is delicious. I've tried the egg fried rice with crab. That was actually really nice. Again, I'm not a big crab lover. I tried the steamed crab. Again, very nice, not a strong flavor. You can tell the seafood is very fresh. If you're looking for a nice restaurant on the East Coast, then maybe you want to check out this one. I will put all the details in the description and down below. I will let you know the cost of the meal on the video now. But I hope you've enjoyed this and uh, please do check out my next video. I'll speak to you soon.